guys welcome back to my beautiful brown life and i want to thank you guys so much for joining me once again on another video and episode but before we get into today's video don't forget to like share and subscribe most importantly and also click on the notification bell so that you can be able to see more videos like this as well as more of what's to come on this channel but if you guys haven't heard already we are a podcast the my beautiful brown podcast is live in color where I share and talk about topics that really speaks to us, especially as people of color, as well as different false stereotypes that are, you know, labeling people of color and people of different nationalities who are people of color too, when it comes to what we do, how we are, the different things that do affect us, but sometimes we may not feel as though we have the open floor to speak on it, or we don't feel as though we have the courage to speak on it. So that's why I created that podcast where I have different narratives different guests coming on and we have a dialogue and a discussion so don't forget to visit my podcast the my Leaf for brown podcast right here and also you can visit that link so you can listen to the podcast that i already have up so without further ado let's get into today's episode okay guys so today's episode we're all about spilling tea <laughs> No, nothing like that. We're actually going to be talking about Rishi teas. And if you guys have been following my channel, you know that I'm all about holistic health and herbs. And I have featured different tea companies on my channel. You know about their public of teas. You know about Choice Tea Company. I've featured other teas. But I'm also interested in giving you guys a different experience and showing you guys other options that you have at your disposal. So the teas that I'm going to be featuring with you right now, it's actually a combination of loose tea leaves as well as tea bags. And without me knowing, I was so shocked to know that Rishi Teas also sent me a tea steeper. So I have a tea steeper to steep my loose tea leaves. So I also am going to be featuring a demo tutorial as to how you can use a steeper with your loose tea leaves. So you'll be seeing that momentarily. But today I'm just going to be sharing with, sharing with you guys my experience and then you'll be able to see my demo tutorial. Okay, so let's get started. So the first tea that I'm going to be sharing with you guys is the loose tea leaves right here. And this is the teas. And I actually will be sharing photos of these tea leaves because I actually did take photos of all of the tea bags that originally came in the bag and I will be featuring them on my blog in particular because what came in this box in particular and within my demo tutorial you'll be seeing me take out some of these tea bags but what came in my bag was a peppermint medley tea, a chamomile medley tea, as well as other tea samplers based off the original, based off the loose teas that I have right here. So what I have right now is I have chili and mango, these right here, and I will be sharing with you guys how the tea bags look within my demo tutorial. And what I love is that all of these teas, they tell you if it's caffeine free, and instantly on this as well as they give you a caffeine meter as you can see it says low medium and high so that's what a lot of these teas offer offers you and they even have english breakfast and this tea is perfect for digestion and after you eat this is black tea and of course this is high in caffeine so this is just an assortment of teas that i have right here in a box so and i will be showing you guys everything that's in here in the demo tutorial so i'm not going to get into all of this right now but i will be showing you guys the loose teas that i have i actually have moonlight jasmine this is a moonlight jasmine loose tea as you can see. these are tea leaves that are within this and this is a green tea with jasmine and this is high in caffeine and what i love this tea that it actually tells you how long it tells you the amount of caffeine it is and it also tells you the preparation how long you should steep it for the amount of water you use and you have to steep this for three minutes and they even give you a short character a flavor character a flavor profile of each tea um this said that this tea is tender green tea leaves um tea leaves infused with lush alluring fragrance of fresh jasmine blossom and this is, a, and you see it tells you it's a scented green tea. So this tea, what I love about this company is that they educate you on your teas before you actually sip them. They give you a semi profile as to what you're gonna be consuming. And so far, I've been seeing most tea companies do that as far as the teas that they have. They give you a semi character description as to what type of teas you're gonna be consuming. So this is amazing. This is the Ginseng Detox. 
this is a botanical flavoring it has um rose hip organic peppermint organic licorice root raspberries organic dandelion root organic burdock root and organic ginseng as you can see it tells you on the behind how much caffeine it has and it doesn't have any caffeine in it it tells you how to steep it so this is the ginseng detox this is the omija berry blush okay so so this is the omija berry blush and I actually have the Omaja Beauty Berry. It doesn't have any caffeine in it actually, but I actually tried this tea out for myself. And I'm gonna keep it real with y'all. This is how it looks inside. These are the, the different berries that are in here and you just steep it in the steeper. And I'll show you guys my steeper right now. But this is the actual steeper, this is the box. And what I love this set, this steeper actually gives you instructions to how you use it and as to how much you should of the amount of the tea leaves that you do put in it. So that's what I love. They give you everything that you need. But I'm gonna talk about this tea in particular because I actually tried this tea recently, um, actually a week and a half ago. And I'm not gonna lie, the flavor was very, it was new to me. Cause I've always been a tea drinker. I've been drinking teas ever since I was a little girl uh, with my, past fire and my sippy cup full of bush tea <laughs> with peppermint and lemongrass and all that bit but honestly this omija beauty berry tea um it was definitely interesting because i felt a little hazy a little bit because i don't know if i should have drank a small amount of the tea but not saying that it's bad by all means but these teas are also herbs, so you definitely have to be careful. Let make sure that you're drinking tea on a full stomach and you're not like almost to the brink of like you're hungry and you need faint. So definitely be careful. But this Omija tea, the flavoring is nice. But then after you taste the berry taste, then there's this strong bitter aftertaste afterwards. So this will, I would, I would definitely not categorize this as my favorite, but I love the other teas that they do have. So this one is okay. It may be good for you, but maybe not for me. <laughs> but so far, I love the tea company. And this is the Blueberry Rebozo. And this flavor in particular, my mother loves this one. And in the demo tutorial, I will be featuring this tea, that I'm, the tea leaves that I'm gonna be straining and steeping so this is the actual tea you see the herbs i smell the actual blueberry I smell the currants i smell the strawberries the hibiscus flowers i smell everything so yeah but this valerian dream this is right up there with their chamomile medley tea i love that this tea has valerian root cardamom organic fennel seed and it also has spare mint and natural rose extract and real roses within it. So this is perfect if you want a natural relaxing tea to drink when you are about to go to sleep. So this, this tea is perfect y'all. And definitely recommend this for future uses, especially if you would like something nice and calming, but also has exceptional nutritional benefits. And this doesn't have any caffeine in it and you only steep it for five minutes this is perfect i actually steeped three cups for me my mom and my sister and my mom actually appreciated the taste um, for what it was my sister she felt as though she wasn't tasting anything because it is a light tea it's hibiscus and it has light it's a light flavor so if you're not interested in anything tutti fruity this is perfect it's light and it's clean and this is the turmeric ginger tea if you are a part of the turmeric craze, we um, they definitely have a lot of this. This turmeric ginger tea is perfect, especially if you want to combine turmeric and ginger, which is perfect. Both are perfect for anti-inflammatory and digestion. But what I love with this tea is that all of these teas right here, they taste organic. They taste healthy. I'm not selling this because, oh, wow, I sent teas. Ooh, no, I'm selling... Um, sharing this with you because I love tea. I drink tea on a daily basis, morning, afternoon, and nighttime. Especially as a woman, I drink a lot of herbs because around that time of the month, the last thing that you want to do is be cramping up and then you can't get your stuff done. So especially since I'm in school, I don't have time to have a downtime when it comes to that time of the month. So I drink a lot of herbs. 
I drink a lot of berry teas because that helps with the uterus and everything like that. So definitely natural teas, especially turmeric and ginger. This is perfect for, you know, cramps too and different PMS symptoms. So turmeric and ginger are perfect teas for you on that time of the month too and hormonal balance. And then you have the jasmine pearl tea. And then you also have the dandelion detox. And my mom is all about the dandelion detox and these detox teas. And this tea has low caffeine, it has a low caffeine meter, as you can see. And it tells you everything that's in here. And all of these products are 100% organic and vegan. So you don't have to worry about anything or any artificial things happening. And these products are amazing. And you can actually purchase this product at Reishi Tea. Dot com and I'll be placing the URL right here, reishitea.com. And also, you can even find these products at your local retailers. And if you visit their website, you will know exactly where you can find them. But let's get into my demo tutorial without further ado. And here is my demo tutorial featuring the blueberry ribozo tea. And let me get us the blueberry right here. Bam! This is featuring the blueberry ribozo tea. That's right here that I was able to drink and enjoy and this is my tea steeper this is what it looks like and I'll be doing a semi demo tutorial showing you guys exactly how to use a tea steeper as well as the purpose of the tea steeper and everything in between so let's get into that video right now okay guys so let's get started today I'm gonna to be showing you everything that came with the tea steeper it came with this tea steeper it came within this box as well as the tea steeper itself with the strainer cover that I can use to strain my loose teas with and here's my trusty cup that you've seen in a couple videos which is my favorite and here is a tea sampler the reishi tea sampler featuring the matcha super green tea um, the cocoa tea as well as the jasmine tea and I do have an English breakfast uh, yes chili mango and I do have an English breakfast that came within this tea earl grey this is quite a taste. Yep, there goes English breakfast, as well as the black lemon and the jade cloud. So these are all the teas that came within the box. So I love that each of these teas are organized and they tell me exactly how long I should steep a tea for. But without further ado, let's get into using the actual tea steep. So here is the blueberry ribosa tea steeper um, tea itself. And then you actually use two teaspoons of the actual loose tea as much as you would need and what I love is that they give you all the instructions that you need on the back of the actual packaging as well as how much caffeine is within it as well as how to prepare the tea yourself so here's my teacup and I actually already have preheated hot water so I do recommend this when it comes to using the actual loose leaves so here is my hot water going into the steeper make sure that you don't touch the actual steeper itself because it's glass and it will burn your hand so that's my tea steeper cover that I just placed on there and it tells you exactly how to steep it. I love that it comes with instructions and even on the packaging tells you how long to steep your tea so five minutes we're gonna do that. So this is my tea and let's get into finished product. So here is my trusty cup and here is the steeper. So here's the tea going in it and this tea is amazing it has dozens of nutritional benefits black currant berries perfect for women and our whole reproductive system and everything just happens so beautiful guys so now you know how to use a tea steeper and now you know how to assemble your tea leaves using the rishi tea tier but i hope that this video was helpful towards you and also if you guys would like more savings you can visit reishitea.com to see all of their coupons their amazing deals that they have and plus these teas are very much cost effective honestly and what i love with this tea steeper is that it's a simple way to brew your tea without it's and it's difficulty free all you have to do is add in your leaves your hot water put down the steeper meter the actual cover itself and then you pour it out and it actually has a strainer right here so none of the leaves will get into your mouth but ultimately guys my whole tea experience with reishi tea has been a breeze i mint this one in particular the beauty berry tea i will honestly say that this may be a fancy for someone else but definitely not for me so 
I will definitely be doing some giveaways on these teas. So if you guys would like to be in on my giveaway, don't forget to comment down below and let me know which tea you would like to try and we can we can work something out. <laughs> but thank you guys so much Reishi Tea for giving me this experience and for sharing and for allowing me to share this experience with my fam. And I want to thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe and comment so that you can get in on these teas. And also, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later on another video on another tea excursion. But D, <laughs> I'll see you guys later. Bye for now.